Introducing Grant Corruption. Grant corruption is the abuse of high-level power that benefits the few at the expense of the many. Grant corruption causes serious and widespread harm to individuals and society. The Gambia is the smallest country in mainland Africa with a population of less than 2 million. Its economy is heavily reliant upon the export of peanuts and around 50% of the population lives in poverty. Yaya Jame seized control of the Gambia during a coup in 1994, overseeing a brutal dictatorship for 22 years. Countless human rights abuses and corrupt practices were recorded by national and international organizations. The Organized Crime and Corruption Reporting Project, OCCRP, estimates that the regime plundered $1 billion from the country. Gambian citizens were left without health care, schools, pensions and basic infrastructure. The corruption of Yai Jame in these past 22 years was a brutality in this country. The whole country was victimized, people were killed, people were disappeared. They pushed people and tortured people's mind that nobody would work on his own. Everyone was working to please him. We've seen what corruption could do to a state. An underdeveloped state with corruption will never ever develop. The OCCRP estimates that Jame misappropriated over $975 million of state funds, looting vast sums from the central bank, the state pension and welfare funds, as well as the state-run telecoms and oil companies. <laughs> So the security has been weakened to a level that the president actually does whatever he wants with the institution. Jame's regime brutally repressed political dissent through mass arrests, torture, and forced disappearances. Corruption was the driver and the enabler of the regime's countless human rights abuses. Shouting, running, guns and bullets firing up. On my way running, I, I was shot on the middle of the road here. I find myself being hospitalized. My treatment was in copy because a big man was enjoying the money. <laughs> yeah, I am. Grand corruption motivates and enables human rights abuses and atrocities. Grand corruption blocks our achievement of the Sustainable Development Goals. The international community must prioritize tackling grand corruption and agree strategies to stop state capture by private interests around the world. <laughs>